What's up everybody? Blue Gabe. For those of y'all that follow along really well, you guys know that I've been building this big, huge, massive driveway. Now I started out in my mangrove snapper video that I did a couple weeks ago where I showed you the tearing out process. And for the last four videos that I've done, I've showed you the whole entire process of building this huge driveway. We're done now and I'm about to show you the end results. So as you can see, we brought in sod, we put in a new culvert and we poured this huge driveway. Now the reason I built such a big driveway besides that my kids love to play is so when I'm backing my boats in, I have plenty of room because you can see I have a duck boat, which I don't use for duck hunting. I use for fish gigging and everything else. I have an airboat and I have a bay boat, but I also needed a little bit of privacy so I put in a hedge and some beautiful sod. And now I have a 72 yard driveway. Luke, show me a pop of wheelie. Bam! You ready to eat some lionfish for dinner? I'm ready to eat that cupcake. A cupcake? Oh yeah, I forgot to tell everybody. I did, I forgot to tell all y'all that my birthday was yesterday. I turned 29 years old. I've been turning 29 for like the last 12 years so just get used to it because I'll be 29 next year. Kelly got me an amazing gift that I'm going to show you in a minute and she also got me a really cool cake. But right now what all of y'all came here to actually watch is me catch lionfish with my hand. Just know that what you're about to watch should never be done by anybody unless you're crazy experienced because lionfish will destroy you. If you aren't experienced do not do what you're about to watch it is not the smartest thing ever i'm not gonna lie but i have caught thousands of them so i know what i'm doing so let's go to jupiter florida 80 foot of water and show you all how to catch a lionfish by hand and when you get back i'm going to show you what kelly young's doing in the house right now because it's pretty entertaining and then we're gonna clean some lionfish and cook them so hope you all enjoy these style of videos they're sort of like a vlog slash Catch, clean, and cook.
Do not try that unless you're experienced. I love doing it that way. And the reason I was catching them by hand was I didn't have a spear. I was actually catching lobster and I didn't have a spear, but I had a net. Hey, I put them in the bag and we're having them for dinner tonight. Babe, what are you doing in here? Redoing your room. Why do you always call it my room? Uh, well, I'm making it our room. How about that? You want to tell, what did you, what did you do earlier with the paint? Spent $70 on the wrong color. Why don't you have Luke in here helping you? He's very good at painting. Yeah. Yeah? At art. Do you um, think you can paint this room without getting paint on the floor? Or uh, on the deer heads? Tell everybody the truth. Do you think you can paint without getting paint on the floor? I picked art as as snack at school. Art as a snack at school. <laughs> No, but I have my snack after art, oh. and, and uh, my teacher, well. and my, and my art teacher lets me paint. Can you tell me why there's a deer laying on our guest bed? He's taking a nap. Wake up. That's why. Wake up. <laughs> I don't think he's waking up, Luke. You ready? Hey, to... he's sleeping Luke. too. Oh yeah, he is sleeping. Are you gonna help me cook in this episode, Luke? If you let me have a cupcake. He Ooh. keeps talking about these Why cupcakes. Should I show him what we got, what you got me for my birthday? Yeah. All right, let's show him right now. Give Jake a piggyback ride and, and have I'll Jake close Who's going to leave me? I will. How about Luke? <laughs> or no. Luke. Yeah. All right, you ready? He's doing way worse of a job than I would do. <laughs> if right. I hit the door, I'm going to be so mad. Hold on. Here. Come on, All right, take a step. <laughs> All right. <laughs> This is weird because I pretty much have everything on the planet yeah, that I want. Exactly. This is why it was so hard. All right. Yeah. Jake is doing a terrible job. <laughs> so close there. your eyes. Close I'm your... trying. I'm about to fall. <laughs> close your eyes. We're almost there. <coughs> He's poking my eyeballs out. I'm falling. Oh. All right. They're still closed. All right. There we go. Walk straight. <laughs> Where's the shed at? Oh. <laughs> you already passed it. <laughs> is it my new airboat? Yeah, no. Your new airboat. All right. <laughs> Wait, hold on. All right, put your hand over your eyes. Now you got it. All right, come here. You saw this at the Chapman yesterday. I did. <laughs> oh, oh, he's I've been me. looking at it, but I didn't know where to mount it. I guess we can mount it right over there. Anywhere. Are you? You don't like my cutting board over there? I mean, I just think it's time to upgrade. You know, you got five hundred thousand subscribers, and I think five hundred eight. Five hundred eight thousand. Dad, now I have something to clean my fish on whenever I do a video. You ain't even told yeah, me about your I fish. do better That's... with this. Of a one, this this plane. one. Yeah. As soon as we picked it up, Jake's like, "Oh, now I have somewhere to clean my fish." Nice and fancy, dancy. Yeah. How'd it get dirty? <laughs> Where do we mount it though? I don't know. We'll have to figure that out. Y'all already know that cutting board was amazing. And we're going to mount it out there somewhere and we'll be using it a lot. But check this out. We're that blue dot right there. But check this out. Not only are we lucky enough to have one hurricane, but we got two hurricanes sneaking up on us in the same exact line. The keys is going to get it tomorrow. And it's looking like this one might hit the Bahamas or right around Miami. Mm. All right, so I get a lot of requests to do steam fish and I've never done it. We're changing that. So this isn't the lionfish you just watched me catch with my hands. Yes, I did use a dip net, I already know that. But I still grabbed them with my hand and when I put them in that bag, they were not hurt. So I called it hand catching. This is from a honker lionfish that I actually speared with no cameras running. Now, if you want to see me clean one, y'all check this out.
That's how you clean one. All right, here we go. A little bit of Lowry's garlic salt. Nothing special. I'm breaking this. This has got a little bit of angel hair pasta. I don't know if that's Thai or Chinese or Japanese. And then we got some tomato gravy, which is Southern and steamed fish, which is I'm sure something else other than Southern or that. You guys, I'm going all over the place with this meal, but I guarantee you it's going to be good. It's super cheap, super affordable. I use okra out of the can and stewed tomatoes out of the can. I was going to do steamed broccoli and fish, but I figured I already had my vegetable. So I would normally eat the stewed tomatoes and okra with white rice. I was walking through Publix, saw the rice noodles, and I'm like, that would definitely go together. And that's what led me to steam the fish. So I think this is gonna be a perfect dish. All right, let's watch how this goes down right here. Y'all pay attention. This is Southern Ingenuity at its finest. This is, it's pouring down rain. I'm stuck in the grocery store and I'm gonna figure out something awesome to cook for dinner. Y'all hear that lightning? That wasn't somebody knocking on the door. That was lightning. Rice noodles. Got it? A piece of awesome steamed lionfish. Right on top, just like so. Okra and stewed tomatoes. Guaranteed to make your mouth water top of that obviously you know the Arrington's love our garlic bread looks good it smells good but can y'all smell that hmm. let's go sit at the table Luke you want some fish come here all Luke has been talking about you guys it's alligator season starts in two days the day the hurricane or it's not even a hurricane I shouldn't say hurricane it's a tropical storm but it wreaked havoc on Dominican Republic. If any of y'all are watching from there, I feel bad for you and hope you a speedy recovery. Isn't it cute? Kadoo. When you turn 29, that's what you get for your birthday, an alligator. Why'd you put 40, <laughs> why did she put 41 in there? Dad, remember when I turned five? Yeah? I had an alligator party. Oh yeah? And I had an alligator. Well, Lukey, I have some news for you. You know how Kelly was helping you with your reading words earlier? She can't count because she put 41 and I'm only 29. I actually want Kelly Young to try this first because oh. have you ever even seen a dish like that? This is a Blue Gabe style dish, I can tell you that. I guarantee you right now there's a lot of people watching this because this is such a mixture of cultures thinking that's going to be amazing. And I, just from smelling it, I already know what it is. We got some noodles, some okra, which I don't, I don't know if I, if I had okra, I don't even know. Did you see how bad the lightning, you couldn't because you were facing this no. way. Lightning just struck so bad. All right. You've definitely never had that combination even heard of this combination <laughs> well I know Jamaicans eat a ton of okra okra actually originated in Africa it's good I like it it's different and it's nice because it's not like an overpowering strong flavor it's very light if you like tomatoes you'll like this dish yeah, there was actually big chunks of tomato, but I took them out because I don't like the big chunks. Those chunks? They're way bigger than that. Really? Hmm. I squeeze all the juice out. It's good. I like it. Those noodles are bomb. Mm -hmm. I love rice noodles. Look, it just struck again. How about the other morning when we were sleeping at like 4 a.m.? I thought it struck the house. Yeah, it was loud. I mean, like, it woke me up from my sleep. And let me tell you something. As I've gotten older, I think I've become more of a light sleeper, but when I was younger, say like 12 years old, my mom used to wake me up in the morning to go to school and she's like, Kelly, did you not hear the fire alarm last night? And I was like, no, dead asleep. Hey dad. Hey Wookie. When I heard that thunder in the morning, I blew up out of my bed. 
Are was, you gonna eat those pasta off the side of your face? <laughs> Have you been I was it? so scared of that lightning, and then I blew up out of my bed. Mm. Do you want a cupcake? The only way you can have a cupcake is if you sing me happy birthday. Happy birthday. No, not now. When time comes. I need to taste the fish still. Man, it looks good. What is this? And we got to show them this right here. Dun, 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 dun. I'm going to pick out the No, I'm going to start from the beginning. All right, y'all, this is where Blue Gabe originated, right here. Don't mind the birth date because it's totally false. 29. That's my fat little feet. Look, there's my... Oh, man, the glare is bad. I didn't even check it for bones. You got a bone? I swallowed one. Oh, you'd be all right. Look at all... Look at all Walt. Little Blue Gabe, a little baby Blue Gabe. All right, we're going to skip this one because it's got my mom. Pretty much giving birth. They said I came out talking. I will, you know. There's young deer meat for dinner. A blonde hair. A blonde hair deer meat for dinner, which Loki's hair is crazy blonde. Way blonder than Jake's was. Oh, y'all just might have seen my package, but y'all have all seen a package before, so we're good. Check out my mom looking, looking all. That's your mom? Yeah, it's mom. She's looking good. Dun, 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 dun. Look at me right there. I still like to take baths. I don't know if y'all like. How many? You leave are, a, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> leave a comment below if you like to take a shower or a bath. I'm a bath guy. I'm a bath guy. I'm... Me too, Luke. Knuckles. Are you a shower or a bath? Shower all day. I mean, look at that right there. Bang! Me in the bath, swimming. Let's let's hurry up and get this done. Yeah, y'all have all seen me looking like that. There's dad, all skinny and tan with his short shorts. Now I can say you looks look like, like I your peed dad. in that water. Probably did. Probably did number two. There's my aunt Susan. I have there's, an aunt Susie too. There's deer meat. Look at that. Looks just like Luke. Hey, let me see. You guys talk about child abuse. My mom used to leave me in rabbit cages, and I love her for it. There's a pony. There's Britos Mas Grande, a.k.a. Aubrey, my oldest brother. Dear me, Robert, and me. Dad. Huh. If your subscribers know my horses from last year. What's your horse's name? It was like five years ago. Luke, you're only six. This is my one of my favorite pictures right there. Look how I look but cute right there. I had a pony that was named Tudo, and I had a um a horse that was named Banjo, and Banjo um a, was bigger than the pony, and he and he ran into. The you got to look at your audience when you're talking to him. He ran into the pony and. And you forgot what you were saying? <laughs> yeah. All right, we'll get to that on the next episode. All right, so here's a fun fact. Y'all see that blue nightgown? Y'all see that nightgown right there? I sucked my thumb until I was like 10 years old, and I whittled that thing all the way down to it was like six inches, and used to rub it on my nose and suck my thumb until I was 10. And my mean, cruel brothers used to paint my fingernails with that nasty taste in fingernail polish to where I'd put it in my mouth, yeah. They never dared mess with my little nightgown though. I'd have killed them for that. It doesn't surprise me. This is Luke right here, AKA you, but Luke. This is, I love these pictures. Look at that does look just like, Luke. I have right? cankles in that picture. <laughs> look at them socks. That oh, looks geez. just like Luke too. Yeah. Look, there's Luke, look at me and smile. Aye. And there's me. I got puppies right there, probably my dad's hog dogs. This can be a long video. There's, I can tell you one thing right now. I can tell you the story behind that hog and I can remember it like it was two days ago. That's deer meat and me. That hog, I thought killed us pretty much, but I think I was dramatized a little bit. That's it. That's it? Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. I'm gonna eat this dinner. We're gonna sing happy birthday and eat some 
cupcakes, but y'all have all seen that done before. We do have two tropical storms bearing down on us, so we're gonna sort of batten the hatches around here tomorrow. I'm gonna edit this video and get it up for y'all to watch. Right now though, it's time to get the heck out of here, just like Jake always says, and get the heck out of shape. See y'all.